Ever wondered how honeybees find their favorite flowers? These tiny marvels have five eyes, two large compound eyes on their head sides, and three smaller ocelli eyes in the center. The compound eyes are sensitive to the blue end of the light spectrum, which extends into the ultraviolet. Flowers emit substantial ultraviolet light, appearing incredibly bright to bees and leading them to nectar sources. And here's a fun fact, bees can't see red. So next time you spot a bee buzzing around blue flowers, you'll know why they're so attracted to them. What makes the flight of honeybees so efficient, you might ask? Well, it's all down to their unique wing design. Honeybees are equipped with four wings which, during flight, cleverly hook together to form a single larger pair for improved aerodynamics. And when it's time to land, these wings conveniently detach for easy compact storage. But let's not forget the ingenious design of their legs. Honeybees have three pairs of legs, each with a specific purpose. Their rear legs, for instance, are adapted with stiff hairs to gather pollen, forming those golden pouches you often see on diligent worker bees. And the front legs? They come with specialized slots for antenna cleaning, keeping these crucial sensory organs free from debris. Clearly, when it comes to multitasking, honeybees have it down to a fine art. Do bees sleep? How far can they travel? You might be surprised to learn that honeybees do indeed rest, averaging between 5 to 8 hours of sleep daily, mainly at night. This downtime is essential, particularly when the veil of darkness restricts their foraging activities. Fascinatingly, sleeping bees exhibit distinctive behaviors like leg flexing and antennae stillness, further showcasing the intricacies of their rest cycles. Now let's talk about their journey. The average flight range of a honeybee is typically less than a mile from their hive. However, they can venture as far as 5 miles for nourishment. This means a thriving colony could collectively cover the distance from the Earth to the Moon each day. So, while they may be small, honeybees are capable of covering impressive distances. How do honeybees navigate and survive harsh winters? Well, these industrious insects use the sun's position and Earth's magnetic field to navigate. Even in poor weather, their sensitivity to polarized light helps them maintain orientation. When winter comes, rather than hibernating, honeybees cluster for warmth, relying on their honey stores for nourishment. Their bodies adorned with branched hairs serve as efficient pollen collectors, attracting pollen grains through an electrostatic charge. It's clear that honeybees are well equipped for survival no matter what challenges they face. Did you know that honeybees can dance? This might sound like a whimsical notion, but it's a crucial part of bee communication. When a honeybee finds a rich source of food, it performs a unique waggle dance. This rhythmic movement is not just for show, it communicates the direction and distance of the food source to its hive mates. Each twist and turn is a coded message, a map leading to nourishment. So, the next time you see a bee doing a little jig, know that it's sharing some valuable information with its fellow bees.